So here's just a quick example of finding a forest fire. Right now it's set on relative temperature, so not any specific ranges, just the hottest thing in the image is going to be lit up, which right now is going to be that engine. Um, we have a burn pit, which is deceivingly deep. A rainstorm's on the way, and there's also a strong wind blowing into the farm field, so it's safe to light this thing up. And I'm going to use this opportunity to show you guys a little bit about what fire looks like on just relative temperature and how much it sticks out on thermal, even through the, the tree cover without smoke or anything. So we're going to light this thing up, uh, let it burn for a little bit, just get it going. And then we're going to go all the way back to the farmhouse and fly up and just see how easy it is to actually find a fire when you're actually looking for one. So you can see once that fire is lit, it's obviously glowing red hot. It's the hottest thing in the image. And since we're not looking for any specific ranges, the bodies around the fire, the people walking around, are no longer visible because the fire is at such a high temperature compared to everything else. Um, it's kind of whitewashed. So we'll let this burn for just a little bit, get a little bit going. Uh, we'll wait till it burns a little bit more and the smoke is actually gone, so it's not as obvious to find. But you can still see how easy it is to spot on thermal. It just sticks out like a sore thumb. Go up a little bit higher. Yeah, you can see that strong wind. It's a very strong wind blowing into the farm field, so anything uh, coming out of that fire is not going to light anything in the forest. There's no chance of that happening. And there are different color palettes and stuff that we can play with, uh, different settings, and we'll switch to something that's a little bit more visible so there's more to look at when we fly back out to actually find the fire. So we're just going to send it straight up and in the general direction. Now I know where I'm going and which way I have to go, but let's just pretend for a second that we just have a general location or just a direction and we have to go locate either a campfire that wasn't put out properly or just something that needs to be attended to and we need to know exactly where it is and where to send resources to to, to deal with it. So. Pay attention to this body of water on the left here. It'll actually be visible on the thermal because it's still holding residual heat from the sun. The water's, uh, the surface of the water is heated up a little bit. So you can actually see when we get a little bit closer, it'll start picking that up. You can see that, that uh, discolored spot a little bit on the thermal where that water is. Now we should be able to start seeing the fire on thermal even before we can see it on visual. And if you really have your, your settings dialed in, it's super duper easy. We can't see it on visual quite yet, but it's sticking out like a sore thumb on thermal. Even without smoke or anything, You can see how easy it would be to, to utilize this resource and be able to find stuff like this. Now the same thing applies for people as well. If you put in the settings for that, you could in theory fly over and find a person if you had it set to look for body heat. 